people. What is going on, my people? Just outside, man. I had to finish all my work for the week. Um, we're going to finish strong all the way through Halloween. We got a lot of orders set up. Um, but, you know, in the meantime, you got to get outside and get some of that air, man. It's a good day, especially if you're in Houston, Texas, man. If you're in Houston, Texas right now, the weather is beautiful. And you can go outside and pay yourself. You done paid all your bills. You listen to everything them kids had to say. Put your hands on your knees and listen to them. Hey, what, what, what do you want? You didn't, you didn't find out what everybody in your house want. Go pay yourself after that. When you give all your energy to everybody else, how do you get your energy back up? You go pay yourself. And so, just out here trying to pay myself, man. But I want to talk about something that I saw this last week in Vegas that I want to help my young adults with. Um, ooh, boy, how, what am I, how am I address this? Um, I'm going to say it like this. Don't be childlike about adult business. Let me explain this a little bit. So, I'm a stepfather. I'm also a godfather as well. So, kids be like, you know, trying to hustle you all day, man. Kids be trying to, you know, put their little hustle in all day, man. They trying to get the resources, man. You know, kids, they want what they want, man. And they're going to come try to get their resources. So, I'll be over here, you know getting hustled by kids all day then i got my god children they like little petty hustlers too they be wanting stuff for they little organizations and stuff they doing so they be sending me fundraising stuff they say eventually we sent you our birthday list and i be getting stuff off their birthday list so i be getting like you be seeing the hustles of children right you see how kids be out here hustling and then you know you become an adult and you done seen these kids hustle you. And then you get around people who are of age and they still trying to hustle you like them children. Stop letting childlike adults get away with this foolishness. Childlike adults. What do childlike adults do? Uh, they do childlike stuff. No, no, no. They do adult stuff then in a childlike manner. So... Go on vacation, don't have no damn money. Um, act oblivious when you um, call their ass out on something. I didn't know that. Don't let them do that. Because that's a childlike adult behavior. They, well, I didn't know. Well, now you know. You know going forward. You know that you acting like a child. And men, when you dating women, sometimes they're going to they gonna, uh, step into your lane and then when it's not convenient being in your lane, they're going to step back and say, but you can't talk to me like that. I'm a woman. Why you talk to me like that? Child like adult. Um, you can't talk to somebody like a child. Um, oh, you can't talk to somebody like an adult from a child like position because a real adult going to sit there and look at you crazy. Like real adults. We can see when someone is acting like a child, like adult. I mean, sitting there like, come on, man, you trying to two timers with that one? Like, what I don't like about this young generation, this 18 to 30 generation, you find a lot of finessers. They great at the finesse. But when they not getting the results that they ultimately want, they get mad at everybody else but their small finesses. When I tell people, um, your life is a is an a is an accumulation of all the little ho shits you done done in your life. So if you just ho shitting and scamming people all over the place, like I be knowing people that be doing childlike stuff, like they'll go through their phone and send 50 people, hey man, I need $25, man. Is it possible you can loan me $25? They're never gonna pay it back. And they're gonna send that shit to everybody on their phone. So if they send it to 50 people and they get 30 people to send $25, they didn't came up. Child like adults. And then they don't even take the money and go do nothing responsible with it. They go ball out on bull crap. Child like adults. Child like adults. And they're going to get mad when you call them on their child like qualities. Because they're not ready to grow up. And you still got to tell them about themselves. 
I don't give a damn if you're not ready to grow up. I'm still going to give you the lesson now. I'm still going to tell you now that I don't appreciate you acting like a child when it's time to be an adult. Like if you come on a vacation, um, you came on the vacation as an adult. You need to leave as an adult. Like when we have experienced you, we need to say, oh, okay, that person acted in a good manner. But then you get these childlike adults. They show up, they don't have no money. They don't want to pay for nothing. They see everybody chipping in and they stand over to the side. I ain't with the chipping in. I'm only with the taking. They like colonizers. Come to take the resources and tear up the energy. So we got to watch out for these childlike adults and we got to call them on it. And then you got to get away from them. You know why you got to get away from them? Because if you stay around them, they're going to think their actions are okay. Just like when you check a child, they're going to be mad. Like, mm. and I'm a stepdad. So I be getting, I be getting some undertone um, aggression. So you get that undertone aggression, but you know it's still there. You still got to call it. But when you're dealing with child like adults, you got to leave these people alone. Love them, but you still got to leave them alone. Why you got to leave them alone? Because they can't come around to you with that childlike behavior. You're going to either be an adult or you're going to be a child. So if you've taken the child route, you're going to act like a child. You're going to take orders like a child. But if you present yourself as an adult and you start acting like a child, I'm going to leave you alone. Because ain't no growth in you right now. All you're going to do is take my resources. You're a child like adult. And then, you know, people go into the world and they don't do good. Um, they don't have good discernment and they don't be seeing people for who they are. They're like, oh, man, I can get them to change. Hey, when you dealing with child like adults and you um, want to marry yourself to that person, not marry yourself, I'm just saying marry yourself to that person. Like you want to you want to go into union with this person. You better know the risk because when they burn you, guess what's going to happen? You're going to run to the Internet. You're going to run to your friends and say, oh, they burned me. It's just like the women that be dating these dudes. Man ain't offered you a ring pop. Hell, if he gave you the ring pop, he'll eat the damn candy off first and give you the damn ring. I ain't promised you nothing. But a child like adult will say, we had sex good, so that must mean we're in a relationship. No, that's thinking like a child. You go say, hey, there will be no sex until we figure out what this relationship thing gonna do. If I wanna be with you, if we wanna be in union together, that's the adult way. But I can't tell everybody how to live their life. That's perfect world stuff. Um, if I'm going to give you, I'll be asking people, man, you want, you want good advice or you want heathen advice? Because heathen advice, it could be 50-50. I'd be like, hey, man, have sex with anybody you want and see how it turns out for you. That's heathen advice. Go on in. Just do whatever you want to do. And if shit don't work out, just blame it on them. Heathen advice. Go on here with your childlike abilities and go try to pimp somebody with your body. And when that don't work, um... Yeah, that's heathen advice. But I can give you some good advice that's probably going to be good for your soul. It's going to be like food. Um, but a lot of people don't like to eat. Not that type of food. Um, they want the um, the burgers. They want the chicken wings. They want uh, the fries. They want all of that. But the good, so that's that heathen advice. That's all of that. You go ahead and get all of that. Um, but if you want the good advice, avoid childlike behaviors. If a man acts like a child and you went into union with him, don't blame the child. Don't blame the child. Blame yourself for you saying, damn, I was an adult, dog. I really should have handled this like an adult, but I have allowed a child into my life. You might be of age, but in your mind, as your mental state, you are still a child. You still act as a child. You still prepare for your life as a child. You do not plan for your life. So your life is childlike. You're talking to 40 year olds, they don't have no plan for their life. And women go into union with these men and expect them to be men when really they ain't figured out how to uh, be a young man yet. They still a child. But I be telling women, hey man, throw out your best qualities on the track. Throw, throw your best qualities out there. All the best stuff that you do, not sex. Uh, we, we working on intimacy. They like, intimacy, what's that? <laughs> that's a whole nother conversation 
but we're going to get back to childlike adults. When you allow a childlike adult into your life that is a as a of age adult, it's hard to get rid of these people. They will ruin your life when you're ready to let them go. That's why you got to sift through these people like you sift through flour. For the people who bake, for the people who use flour, for those who have ever used a sifter, you got to sift through these goddamn people and get on about your life. Avoid the childlike adults. If you want to have a successful dating career, um, you're going to have to look at people. Look at their actions and say, am I dating a childlike adult? And when you figure that out, that you are dating a childlike adult, you need to work on your exit plan. Because the longer you stay, the longer you give them ammo to destroy you. I ain't gonna lie to you, man. I'm an old school. I'm big bro. I'm gonna teach you what ain't nobody else gonna teach you. Big bro gonna let you know.